Uh, I thought it was really good uh, for our character to get that. We've, um, you know, to be in that position and to hold on when the run of the game is going against you. Um, you know, we probably haven't got the experience that we've had in the past of, you know, from, from the changeover personnel. So, um, you know, we, we had layups. We missed the layups at a bounce out. It was – we missed foul shots. Um, you know, there was a lot of stuff that was going – uh, against us in that little part. So I was pretty happy with how the guys finished the game, actually. When did you feel the momentum was starting to swing against you in that second half? When we start to be concerned by it? I think when we fouled the three-pointer, you know, then, then we got our rotations were wrong. We weren't disciplined with our rotations and that hurt us when they got a couple of threes in the corner, some easy points. You know, I thought we played two and a half really exceptional quarters. And then we kind of took the foot off the gas and, and got away from our structures or system. And, um, you know, and, and that gave them points to get back into the game. So you look at your best, you, you know what your best looks like, you know what your worst looks like always in, in the same game. Is that, that a, a good coaching perspective to be able to say, first half is how we want to play? Yeah, and it's just, um, you know, I was really pleased how we weathered the storm with that. Um, we, obviously, we've got to still improve. We're only... Well, now, eight games in. Uh, we are, I forgot what how many games we're in, but, um, you know, that's, that's the part of the growth that we got to understand when momentum, the crowd's in it. Um, you know, we've got to come up with good plays down the other end and, um, you know, that's a part that we've still got to grow about. We're seeing every team battling with injuries at the moment. Bryce got that cork during the third. Was he, just, was he OK? When you put him back out there, was, was it uh, you, we need to win the game and we'll sort it out afterwards, or is it, what's the situation with that leg for going yeah. forward? Yeah, well, too early to tell. I got no idea, but Bryce gave me the thumbs up, so that was all good. Yes, you never come into these things when you win; you only come in when you lose. Um, <laughs> can, you, can you talk a bit about Mitch Norton late? The, he had the, the, the offensive rebound and he got smashed and then he had the, the, the charge he took as well with getting smashed again. Like two really big plays by him which are really important late in the game. Yeah, massive plays. Um, you know, he does so many things well and um, that, yeah, as you said, that last charge call and um, the physicality, he just treats everything as incon inconsequential and, you know, he's, he's phenomenal out there. That last, you know, defence on, on Adnam, um, you know, if he hits that, then they win the game but I thought he did a great job straight up. Um, to force a tough shot, and that's all you can do in that situation. Trev mentioned the, the, the character of the group and the, the turnover of personnel over the past two months. How are you finding as a leader out there um, working through new faces, different blokes? Are you, you're looking out and not seeing the normal guys you would normally see over the years and working through what you want to do? Yeah, look, that's, you know, that's the game, isn't it? Guys retire, guys move on, and... Um, you know, but in saying that, we've got guys that have been around a while now. Um, you know, Nordo's been here a while and he's seen the league, um, you know, all the way down the bench. Um, BC's been here a while, Clint, Toddy's been around, uh, Whitey, and we've got a good mix of youth too. So I think it's actually a good balance. Um, you know, guys speak up when they're, when they're needed and when they, when they see something, and, and that's the way it should be. So um, it makes my job easier, I guess. Anyone else there? Any other questions for the guys? No, I think it's just you, Craig, if you've got any more. That's all good. Uh, so, to Bryce, from a Bryce perspective, just to cover that off, um, he's definitely, you're, you're confident he's okay for Friday or he needs to be looked at. What's the situation with, with that leg specifically? No, obviously, we just finished the game, so I've got to see the medical staff, but he hasn't got treatment straight after the game. He's gone in for an ice bath as per normal, so.